Hey guys, Arbiter G. Vadim here with a review once again on a different kind of uh, radiological sur uh, meter. This is the electromagnetic radiation detector. Um, so today I'm going to clear out any myths or questions about it. Hopefully I can answer all of them without being asked. Um, but so let's get started. That's, this is what the bo what this is what it comes in. And this is what it is. So, what is it? Well, if you're looking for a Geiger counter that can that can detect ionizing gamma or beta radiation, this is not for you. This detects electro um, electromagnetic radiation, or maybe I, some of you can some of you would call it EMF. Uh, but this is basically something that will pick up somewhat harmful radiation output from uh, UV devices such as a uh, fluorescent tube, a computer screen, or in some cases a cellular device depending on how sensitive your device is to it. So pretty simple, power to turn it on and it's going to start displaying us with information. So that's reading zero here because we're not near anything that puts off a uh, electromagnetic frequency. Let's move it to the screen. A little bit of, little bit of uh, radiation coming off of that. Once again, it's not ionizing radiation. This does not have a Mueller tube in it or anything. This is just picking up the UV, basically. So, in a way, it's basically light. And then when that it's got, I think, a uh, threshold of about 500. And when it hits that threshold, it it triggers the alarm. I wouldn't call I wouldn't call 500 necessarily dangerous. I would call I think a thousand dangerous. This is an uh, incandescent light bulb or a fluorescent. Sorry. Oh wait, that is an incandescent. Interesting. That is an incandescent, and it's still going off the charts. And then if you just take a random wire laying around the house, it doesn't even have to be plugged in to another device, it just has to be plugged into the wall. You can go ahead and get some stuff off that as well. Now, to give you some more detail on what this thing does, radioactive fiesta wear. Nothing. Once again, not a Geiger counter. So don't think that uh, this is a Geiger counter of any sorts. It is not. But it is very cheap online. I got mine for about ten bucks, ten to eleven dollars, uh, a few dollars plus the shipping. So, and yes, this is Fiesta Wear. Put it on the times hundred. It is radioactive fiesta wear. So basically, we're not picking up ionizing dangerous radiation. Um, don't get confused because X-ray radiation or X-rays do also count as a electromagnetic free, uh, radiation, but it's not the kind you're thinking of. It's an ionizing kind, but it does. It, if you were talking to somebody and mentioned x-rays they would be like oh yeah uh, electromagnetic radiation so but pretty simple little device um, inside here is a actually instead of a Mueller tube it's an antenna that's just folded and overlapped a few times and then that's what gives you the uh, readings so I'll, I'll give you a little I got some fish pumps down here Not that bad. Some places are worse than others. 
and then it will even go off to like I mean if I was just there's a is a wire from my fish tank for the light so but if you're looking for something cool around the house just to maybe spook your friends out you don't want to invest the money for a Geiger counter uh, something you could take to Walmart to Best Buy or something just mess around with the TVs this is probably kind of cool to get I mean it's really cheap and there's not much to it with Geiger counters you got different calculations and everything um, sensitivity wise I I mean if you're gonna if you're gonna get one of these devices to do mathematical surveys and research I don't recommend this because this is kind of just a is it bad or is it good it's not gonna tell you this little digital screen is just kind of a level based on uh, exposures it's not gonna tell you you know your, your different levels of uh, amounts and everything like that I don't even know how to do the calculations for EMF radiation but once again if you're just looking for something chill around the house scare some friends out or something go ahead and grab it pretty cool 11 bucks can't beat it um, now this will I have not taken it to a substation I kinda wanna go to a substation and uh, put it up to it to put up to the fence or a cell tower see what happens be interesting but um, it takes a little 9 volt battery not much to it circuit board antenna ink screen Ooh, but it will help however um, if you ever wake up in the morning uh, maybe headache or something I, I, I mean I'm just shooting blanks here but it worked for me lately that's been happening to me I've been waking up with a lot of headaches and I purchased one of these to see because people were measuring their uh, their wire what's it called power strip uh, power strip EMF fields and they're registering pretty high it was triggering triggering the threshold so I figured I'd get one do the same thing and I put it next to my bed and um, I have this little uh, power strip that I use for my fish tank bubblers and it went off the charts and so I fixed that I moved it away and so these last couple of days I haven't been having a migraine in the morning which is kind of nice uh, I don't know if that's coincidence or not but I'm still investigating the matter but yeah definitely if you're gonna I, you know what I do recommend getting this it's fun to have and it's some kind of cool just to have but uh yep any questions you, I'll answer it through the comments. See ya.